Today in Masha Abaco, Bahamas, it's the 20th of April, 2023. And I'm doing what my member of parliament, Kirk Cornish, ought to be doing is appealing to the Minister of Immigration, uh, the Minister of Environment, um, to step in to save Grand Key. Uh, there's so much greed going on in Grand Key. Sometimes I didn't want to talk about Grand Key because only I get two votes down there. All them red and yellow, F and M and PLP. Then, anyway, I ain't gonna talk about that because I got two good supporters down there. <laughs> I had two good supporters down there in Grand Key. So you gotta say something because I was in Grand Key. How is it, Minister of Immigration Keith Bell, Minister of Environment um, Juan Miller, that the people of Grand Key don't have a say because immigration must be given these Haitians work permit to compete with the divers of Grand Key. Um, Minister Keith Bell, the Haitian is destroying the lobster ground for the future of the next generation of young Grand Key fishermen. These, th these Haitians, they kill everything. They're worse than the lionfish. You think the lionfish was bad in Grand Key, but you give it five years, you wouldn't see a, a lobster or a fish on the grounds of Grand Key. You have to go further and further and further away. Like in Florida, you gotta go 40 miles offshore before you can get a meal of lobster fish for your family. So I'm, a, I'm appealing to Minister Keith Bell to cancel it's 40 they got 40 haitian divers in grand key how the hell can grand key compete with 40 haitian divers that name cooper and sanders i know their first name they're a bunch of greedy brutes and they can't see nothing but greed but they are killing grand key by allowing 40 Haitians to compete on that little town of Grand Key. Kai Kiss, Minister Bell, send one team down there, please. Please, sir.